Hey guys, welcome back for another bath bomb demo. Okay, so this one is from Witch Baby Soap and this one is the Black Christmas Bath Bomb. Okay, so this one is about the best looking Witch Baby Bath Bomb I've gotten in a little while. Um, a couple of them I've gotten lately have looked a little activated or a little moist. Um, like they've gotten a little moisture in them somehow, but this one looks really, really good. It is a really, really pretty um, dark teal blue, and I think the watercolor is going to be really pretty. It does smell like a spice orange to me. It smells really good, but it smells exactly like the little conversation hearts you get at Valentine's Day. The little candies is to me exactly what this scent is. So it smells really, really good right now. We'll see what it smells like. When it gets in the water if it um it stays that strong but i think this is going to be really pretty so let's get it in the water and see what it looks like Ooh, look at that pigment oh my goodness i did not expect it to be purple at all So pretty. Now this looks different. The actual bomb looks different than the one I remember seeing last year. And now I could be wrong because all you witch baby authorities, um, correct me if I'm wrong. What I remember last year was that this was, um, the Black Friday, I was thinking Black Christmas because that's the name, the Black Friday bath bomb. And that it was purple in color, the actual bomb, and it had silver on top. And I missed out on it and it killed me because I really, really wanted it. And so um, when I saw that this was gonna be available or it was available a little bit longer than it was last year. I was really excited and I thought it was interesting that it looked different um, on the outside. So I guess it looks about the same color maybe because I think it was purple in the water last year. But it is so pretty. Oh my goodness it's pretty. And there's um, there's definitely blue coming out of it like just like royal blue, like Crayola crayon blue coming out of it as well. Okay, let's make sure and get the best part. And it does still smell really, really good. This is not available anymore. I think it was a throwback Thursday bomb. I'm not 100% sure. Well, I might be a little disappointed in that because it was a little too foamy to watch it break apart properly. Unless it hasn't quite done that yet. It's very pretty. The foam is gorgeous. But usually we get to see the coffin break apart a little bit better than that. Very pretty bath art. All right, so that is almost done. Let's take a, one more quick look at it. So pretty. So this watercolor is gonna be awesome. Let's check it out. 
really pretty dark royal purple, super dark. And that just really surprises me. I just knew that it was gonna be blue. It's pretty sure of it. So that's pretty cool. That's a nice surprise. So there is some color back here, kind of on the sides, but I'm pretty sure it's gonna be okay. I'm pretty sure. When you splash it and use around like that, it's probably gonna be okay. I tell you what though, guys, I have had some color grab on my tub lately. Um, I don't think it is any vendor, um, any vendor's fault. I think that it, my tub is getting a little bit older because I've had it happen a few times with some different vendors and they've been quality vendors, um, and different vendors in different colors. So, um, I think that my tub is just kind of getting at that age. So, um, yeah, I think that this is going to be okay, but I am a little more cautious than I used to be as far as putting, um, some different bottoms in my tub and some, you know, some really dark colors, but I think this is going to be okay, but I'll let you know at the end. Okay, well, let's turn on the jets and see what, if we get some bubbles. Now, that looks like a midnight blue to me right now, which is kind of what I was expecting. So, this watercolor is very interesting, very interesting. And this looks like it's going to make a lot of bubbles. So this is going to be a really nice bath. And the scent is very strong. I really, really like it. It's just as strong as the bomb smelled when I opened it and when I set it in the water. So that's good news. Okay, well, I will be back after I grab my shower and take this nice bath and let you guys know how it was when I'm done. See you in a minute. Love that sound. Listen. Lots and lots of bubbles. It goes all the way down to my elbow. Cool. All right, guys. So I'm done with my black. Christmas bath from Witch Baby Soap. And this is what we have left over. That is not pigment down there, it is shimmer. There was a lot of luster in this bath bomb, which was really pretty against that midnight blue purple watercolor. Um, the bubbles left down there are just the original bubbles. I didn't run the jets while I was in there because I wanted to look at the watercolor and I may have had more bubbles than I wanted to if I had done that. Um, overall, I really enjoyed this bath bomb, but the moisture level was only medium. It wasn't super moisturizing and the scent did dissipate while I was in there because it's not lingering in my bathroom or on my skin. Um, I do feel like I'm still slacking a little bit on my bath bomb demos. I'm just super busy right now and I have so many to demo, so I do apologize for that. But um, stay tuned, I do have lots more and I'll try to get to them as soon as I can and as often as I can. I will have all of Witch Baby's links listed down below and I really appreciate you watching this one, so just stay tuned. Thanks a lot, you guys. Bye-bye.